footage of an electrical substation burning in Crimea may suggest that Ukraine's military has new abilities to strike deeper into Russian territory, a development that could potentially change the dynamic of the war. Explosions hit a Russian ammunition depot near the site, which also prompted the evacuation of 2,000 civilians in a five-kilometer radius and disrupted rail lines. Also on Tuesday, a Russian newspaper reported seeing smoke rising from a Russian airbase in Crimea. There's no immediate claim of responsibility, although two members of the Ukrainian president's office hinted at the country's involvement on Twitter in what they called demilitarization, a mocking reference to a word Russia uses to justify its invasion. The war is approaching its sixth month, but until last week, that area of Russian territory appeared beyond the Ukrainian military's reach. That was when explosions hit another Russian airbase, destroying several planes. Russia's blamed Tuesday's explosion on sabotage, a rare admission that forces loyal to the Ukrainian government have hit its supply lines. Crimea, which was annexed in 2014, is used by Russia to reinforce its troops fighting in other areas of the war. Russian authorities reported few wounded and no deaths in Tuesday's incident.